We interrupt your broadcast with this important message from Pokey Perk. Ha, ha, ha. Diet Coke today, my Pokey people. How y'all doing? It's your boy, Pokey Perk. And we got some Pokemon. TCG, Raging Surf, News, Leaks, and Updates. If you wanna be surprised, bounce up out the video. If you wanna know what's crack lacking stick around to the end. Don't go nowhere, and let's jump up in this thing. Okay, my Pokey people. Before we get started, I'm gonna need you to go ahead and hit that like button. Drop a comment down below and tell me if you've seen anything related to this new set, Raging Surf, coming out. And subscribe to the channel with notifications so you can support your boy and stay in the loop for more heat. But anyway, first of all, Pokemon Raging Surf set to release September 22nd, the same date as Pokemon Card 151 English version. Now, Pokemon need to slow down because your boy running out all this money. But they revealed some, some new cards. One of them being the Bombardier EX. This card looks great. And I'm not even a Bombardier fan. I really like it. I like it a lot. Now, if you're wondering what this card's attack does, what it does is basically the same as Luminion. If you remember Luminion V. If you attack with it, you could you have the option to take that card and all the energies and tools and whatnot attached to that card and shuffle it back in your deck. Now this is very helpful if there's any damage on Bombardier and it's about to be knocked out. So that's pretty cool because it takes all the damage away. Also, releasing September 22nd alongside Pokemon Raging Surf and Pokemon Card 151 will be two new Pokemon EX starter decks. And they're not just regular starter decks, these look crazy. One is featuring an electric Terra type Mew 2. This card look crazy. Now, if you're wondering what this card attack does, it does extra damage. First of all, it needs a psychic the psychic energies but it does extra damage per psychic energy attached to all of your pokemon now that that can deal out some mean mean damage and then also we have this skeledurge e x steel terra type this card's looking phenomenal Phenomenal. Now, if you're wondering what this card does, its ability, if you discard an energy from him, it'll deal an extra 60 damage on top of the 160 damage dealt by its actual attack. Now, if you combine these, kind of like how we do like the energy retrieval and stuff when we use the Chi and Pao deck, this can start dealing out some major damage. These cards look awesome. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a fan. I really, really love the Skeletor Steel, and I really like the Bombardier. The Mewtwo's okay, it's not my favorite. Still want it, probably gonna get it. But, November 3rd, November 3rd is our English set for Paradox Rift. This ETB looks phenomenal. I like the colors. It reminds me back in the day when I used to play this like snowboarding game or whatever the heck it was. But it's featuring Iron Variant. The Glade and Gardevoir kind of like Steel Fusion mesh together. And it looks phenomenal. Which this is going to lead me to believe that we're going to have tons of Paradox Pokemon in this set. Probably to include the Walking Wake and all that good jazz. Maybe they're finally going to reveal the Entei. My opinion... 
it's gonna be a triceratops. I know everybody thinks it's gonna be like the flying birdie thing, paradactus, or every say it, pterodactus, or something like that. It's not. It's probably gonna be a triceratops. But anyway, hit that like button. No, no, no. Smash that like button. Drop a comment down below. Tell me if all this is a cop or a drop. Subscribe to the channel with notifications to support. Yo, boy.